الحمد لله رب العالمين له الحمد الحسن والثناء الجميل وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له يقول الحق وهو يهدي السبيل وأشهد أن سيدنا ونبينا محمد صلى الله عليه وعلى آله وأصحابه والتابعين لهم بإحسان إلى يوم الدين أما بعد إن شاء الله تعالى I'm going to be speaking about the relationship between knowledge and life Shaykh Al-Islam ibn Taymiyyah, he mentions in his kitab Majmu' Al-Fatawa, 10th volume, page 146. And he attributes the statement to Yahya ibn Ammar. That Yahya ibn Ammar, rahimahullah, he said, Al-Ulum khamsatun. That the sciences are, three, are five. That the sciences are five. The first one is فَعِلْمٌ هُوَ حَيَاتُ الدُّنْيَا وَعِلْمُ التَّوْحِيدِ A knowledge, a science, which is the life of this world. And it is the knowledge of aqidah and tawheed. So a person learns tawheed, it is حَيَاتُ الدُّنْيَا It is the life of this world. It's what you live for. It is what gives you life. The second one is وَعِلْمٌ هُوَ غِذَاءُ الدِّينِ A knowledge, a science that is the nutrition of your religion. وَهُوَ عِلْمُ التَّذَكُّرِ بِمَعَانِ الْقُرْآنِ وَالْحَدِيثِ It is the knowledge of pondering, contemplating on the Qur'an and the hadith of the Messenger صلى الله عليه وسلم. The third, وَعِلْمٌ هُوَ دَوَاءُ الدِّينِ A knowledge and a science that is the cure of your religion. وَعِلْمُ الْفَتْوَى And it is the verdict. Abdullah ibn Mas'ud radiallahu ta'ala anhu, he said, إِذَا نَزَلَ بِالْعَبْدِ نَازِلَةٌ إِحْتَاجَ إِلَى مَنْ يَشْفِيهِ مِنْهَا Abdullah ibn Mas'ud radiallahu ta'ala anhu, he said, if a calamity falls onto a person or a person is in need of something, he requires somebody to cure him from it. He needs a cure from it. So this verdict is a cure to this illness. So it's, that's why Yahya ibn Ammar called it Dawa'uddin. The fourth one is وَعِلْمٌ huwada'uddini. A knowledge or a science that is the illness of the religion. It causes harm to your religion or it's an illness. It is the newly invented speech. And the fifth, which is the last one, a knowledge or a science which is a destruction of your religion. And that is ilmu sihri wa nahwihi. It is learning the knowledge of um, uh, sorcery, magic. So if you analyze these five, these five types of knowledge or these five types of sciences, you will realize that everything can just be placed in one of those. So you have to ask yourself, this knowledge I am learning that I am studying, what effect does it have on my life? It is it something that gives me life? Is it something that cures my religion for me and answers my problems? Is it a form of nutrition for me to nurture my religion? Is it an illness that I am placing in my religion? Is it a destruction and a harm? And so this benefit truly gives us a true good understanding of what relationship knowledge can have to a person's life. Anything which I have said that was wrong is from me and shaitan and Allah and his messenger are free from it. Subhanak Allahumma bihamdik. Ashadu an la ilaha illallah. Astaghfiruka wa